Hello everyone, thanks for joining me once again. Today we're taking a look at adding catalog, new catalog databases, and even an entry to that catalog. My last blog post we did that using Microsoft, uh, or Microsoft Access. This time we're going to use AutoCAD Electrical. So I'm just going to right click, I'm going to insert a component, and maybe in this case I'll go ahead and add a control relay. So as I apply that in, I go to my lookup table, as this generates down here, we're going to be able to see that we have a, some options under our tables up top here. Uh, with that, we have the ability to go up the stack here and add a new table. In this case, maybe I want my new table to be XX and maybe it's uh, personal components or something. So I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. What we see here is that new table, but now I need to go ahead and add an entry to that table. So I have the ability, um, catalog information, uh, maybe in this case it's uh, my catalog is from Tata. Uh, the manufacturer is, in this case, I don't know, Tata Technologies. Uh, different queries that uh, we may need to use for this. Maybe it's a uh, uh, voltage, you know, maybe it's 120 volt. Uh, my next query, you know, really anything I want in here, maybe it's uh, too normally open. But basically what we need to do here is we can see highlighted in heavy black here, or bolded out, is areas that are necessary. So I'm going to go ahead and select OK to this, and we can see our new entry has been added to our table. I can go ahead and hit OK. We can see that information was transferred across here as necessary. And I can go ahead and add that into my design. So next time I go into here, and I go into Insert Component, and maybe I do want another control relay. I'll just add that in. I can go back to my lookup table. I should have, you know, I could have added some descriptive information to that. Again, wait for my tables here to, to load up so I can go choose a different table. In this case, I'm going to go to the XX, the new database I added, and what we'll see is our new entry here. Now I can go in, I can add that new entry, and it's there for us. So, you know, there's definitely some things you want to investigate. It's an e maybe in some cases an easier way to go about adding new tables. Um, not everybody, you know, my understanding has Microsoft Access, as I did in my last post. But we can go through, and we can do it in this post. So, you know, go through, understand the components, the type of information that we need to add into our, into our components itself. Um, and we can, you know, basically we can go ahead and work from there. So again, just another way of going to add a data, a new da catalog database and adding an entry into uh, that database as it stands. Again, if you have any questions, feel free, you know, reach us at uh, the free support uh, with, you know, inside the CAD Geek blog post. Also, I'll put a reference in there from our last AutoCAD Electrical user group as a link also. Thanks and have a great day.